One Bemidji veteran received an award honoring him for his service in World War II. U.S. Senator Amy Klobuchar presented World War II veteran and former Bemidji State Professor John O'Boyle the French Legion of Honor today. Lacey Montelion has more. Of the French Republic, Private First Class John O'Boyle, you have been appointed a Chevalier of the Legion of Honor. The ceremony honoring Private John O'Boyle with the French Legion of Honor brought together two countries. It was, by all accounts, a moment to remember, but for O'Boyle, it was a moment to remember all veterans. I think in all modesty that I've tried to stress several times is that there are thousands upon thousands of people that are just as uh, eligible as I am. O'Boyle began his military career in 1942, training in England before eventually arriving in France. We marched through the, uh, the, the, <coughs> the uh, Champs-Élysées, uh, down the Champs-Élysées, in a battalion formation, and, uh, and that's where the sort of historical picture was taken. He says going into battle was like having an out-of-body experience. The bullets were going overhead. As long as they go overhead, usually uh, you've had there, there's no problem because it's going overhead, and, uh, and if it is a machine gun, the, 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 the machine gun raises, and so you're in good shape. But apparently they had a rest there so they could bring it back down, and, and I guess they just it went across me. O'Boyle received gunshot wounds to both legs, ending his military career, but that career is once again being remembered. That's what today is about. It's about taking that moment to remember for 4th of July. That's what brings us together. John is a personal friend, and I've known him since I was in college in the 19, early 1980s. So it's really kind of a unique thing to be able to do, a, to put together an award ceremony for John, and I'm, you know, it was a pleasure to do it. And although O'Boyle is humble, he's thankful for the support. We salute our flags, but we also salute our friends. Lacey Montelium, Lakeland News. And we will have the entire interview with John O'Boyle on our website at lbtv.org. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.